It's another busy day at the Acme Paper and Supply Company, and in the weeks to come, it's going to get even busier. Over the last month or so, I mean, there's just been a tremendous groundswell of people looking for paper straws to replace their plastic with paper. A longtime staple in CEO Ron Atman's warehouse is changing over as more of his restaurant and venue customers switch from plastic to paper straws, even though these customers will now have to pay up to four times more as they are more expensive to produce. Over the last uh, 10 years, there's been such a movement from typical plastic and styrofoam products to compostable, recyclable products. So this is just another part of the equation that's, uh, you know, that's taking place now. The real challenge is to try to eliminate this uh, overabundance of single-use plastic that's in our environment that comes from uh, a kind of a throwaway society. At the National Aquarium, its CEO is calling this the tip of the iceberg, that there are more than five trillion pieces of plastic in our oceans today, and the ecosystem is suffering. I think one of the most frightening things, of course, is that there's just so much plastic in the environment and in the ocean and, and bays and streams that animals start to ingest it with their food or think it's food. And obviously, we want to try to prevent that in every way we can. Back at Acme, they say they have plenty of stock and plan on making room for more. And what could help drive these prices up even further, unfortunately, right now, there is only one company in the U.S. that makes these paper straws meaning more competition could help drive that price down. In Savage, I'm Lowell Melser, WBAL, TV 11 News.